what's up guys so today we have an unboxing video my computer has finally come in it's been waiting a while for this so let's get into it got the nice fidget spinner knife cut all the tape if i can cut the tape Another box. It's got a lot of foam pieces inside of it. Like the care they took to package it all nice and safe. Right, so I think what I'm gonna have to do is tip it this way. Great power. It says, please handle with care. Fragile. It's fragile, all right. It's from CLX. It's a pre built company. You choose your parts and then you, uh, they build it, test it, and ship it, which I think is. Really good because you know you're getting a quality build because they're already tested and do everything that they need to do. Thing of foam that's just for safety packaging. Another thing of foam. Got thing to read about. All the PC and stuff to get that stuff out. We've got a box. This has got a uh, label in it that's talking about stuff. We got the great power cord. Definitely need that. And then some uh, the pamphlet of the uh, motherboard, I guess. Turf gaming motherboard. And then we got some turf gaming stickers. This might or might not come with yours, depending on what you get, I guess, because I chose the turf motherboard. I got some other stickers or something. Power cord, definitely need that. We got the computer right here. And it is glorious. I'm gonna need to find a way to get this out. I think I'm probably just gonna do the same thing that I did with the other box. Just gotta be really careful. I'm slide it out. Scoot everything away. Ease it down. Slide it right out. the rest of this guy up. Some other foam stuff in the bottom of this box. And here we have it, the, the great computer himself. here and this right here blows up and that's really cool we got ventilation right there I don't know if that is 
is good ventilation or not, but I hope it is. More ventilation. And we've got a glorious side panel. And all of this stuff will light up. So handle with care, tempered glass. And uh, unscrew the little hand screws to get in here. Peel the rest of the plastic off. Look inside. Mm -hmm. Does look nice. Slide it right open. You can see the power supply. There's my RAM, my water cooling, and then I got this phone inside here. My graphics card. That looks great. This is gonna look great once it's all beautifully powered up. I'm excited. I'm gonna close the glass panel. Oh. Don't want to lose those, those are kind of important. Just going to screw these back on. Make sure not to get fur with the screw. Put those nice on. Okay. So you can look in the beautiful glass. Um, in the back, See this okay so this part is like a magnet or something top ventilation you can put this over this is probably like a dust cover or something you can also take it off but I think I like the dust cover on it makes it a lot like smaller holes and stuff we've got the uh UDI one HDMI internet cord or ethernet cord um Keyboard mouse, got two USB down there, a few more of those. We got another uh, UBI power, RGB lighting, silent mode on and off. That's kind of cool. I didn't know it had that. That's cool. And then you got the power supply right there. Um, that's pretty easy. It looks like this might come off where you can open up the back or something. Oh yeah, you uh, can turn this, so let's, op let's open up this to see how their cable management is if I, <coughs> if I can. I don't, I don't can't, I can't. Okay, maybe we'll open that up later. Um, on top, it says LED, we got the power button. Nice clicky sound. Um, headphones, mic, USB Type C, uh, USB three to USB uh, twos. That's nice. Um, there's an LED thing. I don't know exactly what that's for. This thing's gonna look beautiful once we get it powered up. I'm excited. Let's get it powered up. Okay, so we got all set up. We got the uh, computer down here. We got this two monitors that one of my friends actually gave me, and that same person actually gave me um, two of the speakers, or those two speakers, and actually that subwoofer down there. I'm using like a little like safe as a footrest. Um, yeah, this thing looks nice. I also have my PlayStation down here, keyboard and mouse, which I'm going to change because the keyboard right now is a wave, Logitech wave, which I think is like kind of weird. Um, turning on my PC never gets old. Super cool. Press the little button up here. The fans, the RAM, the power supply. The graphics card doesn't light up, but it is water cooled as you can see by those copper pipes. Um, so that's definitely cool. Um, I'm making this setup video about, I want to say, two months later. Um, after getting the setup because I wanted to play on it and I just never ended up getting to um, the actual, you know, like, finish video <laughs> part. This is a little lapel mic that I sometimes use. I'll clip it to like my headset and then I'll use that because it has some good audio or decent audio better than some of my other mics. So it just takes a second or two to get a beautiful loading screen like each time. 
type in your password and then it's got this beautiful double monitor setup this background that I chose there's multiple um, background, back, uh, backgrounds that I could have chosen but I just chose to um, just go with this one because I just like the mountains in the background I got my games in the center you guys might recognize Fortnite made a video on my computer montage um, so yeah so I've had it for two months like I said um, so far I've loved it um, still trying to get used to typing because you know on my iPad uh, you could just use talk to text luckily I, I had already done some typing programs to like learn typing um, but not much um, well, it was it was a good it was a good bit it was like like a year and a half, um, so yeah I'm still using that. Uh, I'm gonna get a new keyboard and a new mouse, um, sometime sometime. Uh, I got my PlayStation controller because I like playing Rocket League, and Rocket League is one of the uh, games that mostly everyone I'm not saying everyone plays on controller but because it's not like Fortnite where there's like a bunch of different buttons you can play on controller and it's just easier so that's my PlayStation controller got my PlayStation some of the games um, and yeah so that's that's my setup right now I got I got this gaming chair that I think is pretty nice you can roll it forward so as you can see it's got you know the normal gaming chair look it's got the neck rest and then it's got the lumbar support thing. I just have that off right now because I kind of like the straight more. Um, but I don't know. Um, for the first, like, I want to say, like, couple of days. So we painted this desk because it was in this corner already, but it was like green, I think. So we painted the desk, um, and I, I was using a little folding table. Um, but yeah, so that's my setup, got my chair, keyboard and mouse, I'm using those keyboard and mouse for now, for now. I got that mouse pad, it's actually from a place you guys might know it, it's, uh, it's not very popular, it's called Five Below. The RGB doesn't really work well, because you can plug it in right there with a little plug-in thingy, and you can change all the, uh, like lights, that's what this clear thing around it is, but, um, not all of it works, mainly just like the stuff like really close to it works and like the stuff around here is like a lot, um, a lot more dim at least, but it's still a good mouse pad for just being like a black mouse pad. So I'm probably going to end up getting a new mouse pad that's like a big, like an extra large so it can cover like all of it. Probably end up a 60% keyboard, haven't found which one yet, I've seen a bunch of them. Some of them are cheap, some of them are expensive, I gotta find like the right, like in between. I'm gonna get a new mouse probably I'm thinking I'm gonna get a uh, like an actual like mic with like a boom arm because uh, I think that'd be like really cool just like going across from like there to, like in front of my face which would be like right around here ish um, so yeah that's that's the end of the setup video um, so far I've loved my computer definitely would recommend uh, Chances that you get the exact same thing as me are kind of slim. I mean, I can post, I can say what I got in the description. Um, so go down there if you want to see the exact specs of it. Um, but yeah, so that's that's everything I got. Good sound, good monitors, good, amazing computer. See you guys later. Bye bye.